I think you've already noticed, but I'm not very good at being on trend. So in today's video, I'm doing quickfire assumptions. So you know the rules, I'm just gonna read out assumptions that you send me on Instagram and try to answer them as fast as possible. And for some of them, I will give explanations, but fast explanations if I have any. So let's get on with the video. You're a coffee lover. I hate coffee. I prefer to drink tea and hot chocolate. That's the only one I have. You can't drive. I can drive, I just can't drive legally. So let's just say I failed my theory the first time I did it. You like K-pop and your favorite group is Stray Kids. Yes, I like K-pop. I think everyone knows that by now. I don't know if I want to call Stray Kids my favorite, my alt, because I have like three alts because I'm a multi-fandom. I will say, I probably watch the most Stray Kids content right now than BTS and EXO, which are my other two alts. So I guess, okay, yeah, sure. Stray Kids is my favorite right now. You're practically doing this because I did. So with this one, I will say it's half half. I saw so many YouTubers do this since like seven months ago and I really wanted to do that kind of video because I like watching those videos. I always thought because I'm a small channel there won't really be anyone who'll send me assumptions or anyone who even has any assumptions because I'm a small channel. So I will say because we're both small channels I got the confidence to do this video because of you but I wanted to do this video because of all those other YouTubers that I actually saw do this when it started as a trend. Your favourite nickname I've used is Sandra Rue. I mean, yeah, probably because it's like the least violent one or the least insulting one I've had so far, which is like ankle biter and midget. So, yeah. You want to live in a different country one day. That is true, probably somewhere in Asia. You wish you were more confident in yourself. I'm really not confident in anything I do and I always also set myself major goals that probably can't even be achieved. Even speaking publicly that kind of confidence, I would love to have that kind of confidence. For some reason I just can't, I just can't. Like I've even tried drama, I'm literally doing YouTube because of trying to gain confidence and it's just kind of not working. I'm trying to do more stuff to gain confidence, but I'm just not a very confident person. Like, if you meet me in person, you will know I'm literally gonna shy away. So, yeah. You're not enjoying uni life slash experience. I did mention it a bit in the uni video, but I mean, I enjoyed my first year. I did enjoy my second year to a certain point. I mean, it's still not like the worst, I guess, but I would really prefer to actually have a normal uni experience. I mean, I know it's nobody's fault. Like, Corona just happened and it just had to be like that. I'm not the only one who's living through this, but I'm not loving the uni experience because there's so many opportunities that I'm missing out on. You enjoy a hot chocolate rant. I do enjoy a hot chocolate rant. I enjoy the fact that I can have a warm drink with a friend and just rant to them and they can rant back to me. I just love it. Like you just get everything off your chest and you feel so light. You only have a small friend group. Yes, and that's because I've had big friend groups before and Let's just say I've either felt betrayed or just was or they just didn't work out. But that's like a whole story time full of a video, so we can talk about that another day. But yes, I do have a small friend group and I like it. It's better. The stubborn AF. I mean, I'm not stubborn. I just know what I want. So okay, yeah, I'm stubborn. Your video will well and truly show up my assumptions video up. I don't actually think so because, I mean, we're both small channels and you've just started. So like, you're doing really good for a channel that's only started not so long ago and I've been doing this for years and years and years and I still haven't learned. So I feel like we'll either do the same or you'll actually do better. I don't think my video will do better than yours. You're scared of adding some spice. And yes, that is true. I just guess it's because I have a baby face. Most of my clothes are like from the kids section. I don't know, I just feel that like if I wear something more outgoing and something more like my age, I will just feel out of my comfort zone and I will start becoming objectified, sexualized on social media. I want to try and add some more spice to my Instagram, so we'll see. Maybe I'll actually start posting how an old 20 year old should. You wish you liked vegetables. I mean, yeah, like, there would be so many dishes I could eat, or, I mean, I can eat them, I just 
Do I want to because I don't like the vegetables? It's just such a waste of time for me to pick them out and whatever and then I'm missing out on so many great foods. I wish I liked vegetables indeed. You have never thought of the future. I actually have. All my life I've been just thinking of my future. Like literally you can ask most of the people I know for like longer than two years. Since I was in like primary school I've already thought out from like oh, I'm gonna go to this high school because of this and then I'm gonna choose these things because I'm gonna go into this career and then I'm gonna do this in college. I literally had my whole like, let's say 10 or more years planned for myself. I'm not gonna lie, like I did at some point like say, oh, my job is gonna be like a dolphin trainer. Sure, I can swim, but I live in the UK. I don't think I can be a dolphin trainer. I don't even know if we have a dolphin training aquarium. Thing. So these were all the assumptions that I could answer for you. They were meant to be quickfire, I don't know if I answered them all quickfire because I feel like I gave a lot of explanations for most of them. Smash a like if you enjoyed, make sure to comment down below if you have any other assumptions, subscribe to my channel and click the notification bell so you get notified anytime I post another video and I will see you this week or next week with another video. Bye!